I'm John Odom, family man, entrepreneur, race car driver. This is Behind the Scenes, Street Outlaws, No Prep Kings. So it's a 2020 Nissan GTR 50th anniversary. Um, it's the only one in the world. It's probably the most advanced No Prep Kings car ever built. Uh, it's state of the art. David Monday did a fabulous job. I went to him, I said, hey, I want the fastest No Prep Kings car in the world, and here's what we ended up with. So I hope you guys love it and like it, and uh, watch what happens. Is there some controversy with this car? Are people jealous or, or something? Or? Well, as it started, you know, me and Justin had some issues, and we worked that out online, and we talk a little bit. And we're just, you know, we got a grudge race, and it's a pretty big deal. Everybody's talking about it online. And then up and beyond that, when we got here, I don't know how many Sam, how many calls Sam had or, or uh, Tech had, but there was a bunch just trying to get rid of this car out the gate. And this car is 100% stock, roof, rear quarter panels, doors, bumper, this is by the book 100%. Tech guys approved it, ready to go. So I just, I feel like if everybody wants to talk talk to me, just come to me. Let's do it. Or let's figure it out on the racetrack. Don't call. Don't go behind my back. You got something to say, say it to me. You know what I mean? I'm right here in my pit with my car. You want to race? Let's race. You want to talk? Get the out. You guys know uh, I'm in the MPK Invitational tomorrow. We uh, beat Chuck 55. And so uh, here's the race for Justice Wanstrom. Online's been blowing up about it. I talked a bunch of shit. I started this whole deal, so it's my turn to back it up. So we're on the grand for like 10, 11, 12 grand. I'm not sure exactly, but here we go. It's a lot up to 16. So um, here we go. Uh, Justin's having a few problems, and he said he elected to still race. So I'm going to go out in the same lane I just went out in. We're going to bust his ass. <laughs> no, 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 hey, no, no, give it to him, give it to him. All right, that's, first, a, that's, first that's more than five grand. Right, no, first race already off grip, but it's going to be a good rivalry for the whole year. Like I said, one race Friday night, it'll be five grand each from us. Other people may start betting on it. I think up there they're yeah, betting like two, sixteen three, grand. I think got like up to sixteen or seventeen thousand. Yeah, so it's a big race. I was happy that, but I'll come get with y'all. Yeah, we'll yeah, figure it all out. But first race off rip, we got it. We got the win, and uh, we're gonna figure it out. We got an issue going on with the car right now. The car has never acted like that in life. It was all over the track. I was doing my best to keep it in my lane. I did not want to go over on him, but I did not see him over there in the other lane right beside me. So I stabbed the throttle again. The car got unwounded. And it was just, it was a very, very hard, hard race for yeah, both of us. So. It was, for both of us. So, but I'm happy with we'll it. We'll do it again and we'll get the. Hey, yeah. you see this? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good shit. Where's the car at? No, no that's for my car. I know, so I was putting it on. No. <laughs> Kai Kelly, we said we I, I was going to put like an Odom Racing sticker, but hey, listen, I'm going to put it on. You want to know why? Because when I bust that fucker's ass. And then I do a sticker, I'm going to send a rap guy. What you going to do if you wax your ass? Hey, I'll put another sticker. Right. Oh, man, that's going to look oh, great. Oh, okay, go hey. left. Okay, left. Go yeah. left. Left. Hey, what's going to be weird is when you left. watch me gap your ass and you got to right look there. at the sticker. He's going to get another one on there in a little while. It's all right, dude. You're going to do what you got to do. That's right. That's it. Yeah, I'm gonna take that picture. Okay. Right here where I'm at. Where's Kai at? David. He's on the starting line. One, two, three. 
got it. <laughs> All in fun. All in fun. Exactly right. Hey guys, so day two. Um, as you know, or if you don't know, there was a lot of drama yesterday. There was a lot of wrecks, there was a lot of cars totaled, there was a lot of weather issues, there was a lot of drama, a lot of heat. Uh, last night at the end of the track, you know, we the security got a little crazy. I got in between them and Justin Swanstrom. He was really struggling. I mean, he had a traumatic incident just happened to him. His car was on fire. Like, I can only imagine what he was going through. And so we had a lot of drama. And so today's, you know, day two. We hope that, that some of that goes away. We are able to run and uh, make some good passes, and we'll see how it goes, but stay tuned. He, he thought, I mean, literally, when I walked up to him, he thought, you know, hey, man, I was going to burn alive in my car, and that's a big deal, right, emotionally, and then we get out and then had some issues with security, so I was between him and security screaming and yelling, and, so he got, I just, of, he got him out of the car quick. And he did, he like 16 seconds. I was he counting it. Like fell over the wall, he said. Yeah. But then emotionally, he was kind of messed up. And then we had some issues with security. So we got all, it was some drama last night down yeah, there. So a lot of emotion. I heard a lot of stuff going on in the starting line. Yeah, yeah. something happened with Pat Musi, I guess. Yeah. I was behind Dave on the starting line last night. When Dave staged, <clears throat> the security guy came up. I'm behind you making sure your car is straight Lined up, track. which we always do. And of course, your crew is there. But yeah, I'm behind your car watching everything that goes on. We're a teammate. And uh, the security guard comes up and tells me I got to get off the starting line. I said, man, that's one of our cars. Yeah. And he goes, you'll either get off the starting line or I'll move you. And I said, well, good luck with that. Let me know how that works out for you. Yeah. And I said, now run along. I said, I'm busy. Yeah. And then all that happened. Yeah. And then he still wanted to talk about it. So he got his ass chewed in a big fashion last night. Yeah. Uh, and he went and got his superior officer. We chewed his ass. Yeah, and then I have a talk with him down at the end, like, listen, man, this yeah. is trauma. This is people's lives. And you you yeah. can't start telling anybody to calm down when they think yeah. they're burning a lot. Like, yeah. you know, security guys are not, you know, no. they're not trained in trauma. And so we had a conversation about that. So there was just a lot of emotion last night. There was a lot of, you know, a lot of... I was in my car, and I was trying to get the door open. I couldn't get the door open. So I finally started going, trying to go out the passenger door. And basically, uh, you know, I was kind of stuck in my car, and then they... Some people and Justin came to try to help get me out and ripped my left door off. By that time, I was kind of squatted in the yeah. opening for that Corvette small. Yeah. They're trying to pull me out ass first. I'm like, it ain't working, man. They can't pull you out like a suitcase. <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, yeah. I'm like, just stop. People you know? just trying to get you out, though. Yeah. You know no, what I mean? But, Everybody's trying but to But I'm sitting in the car, and all I see is this car, like, yeah. four feet away from my car. Burning like, up. Burning. Just burning. Yeah. It's crazy. Yeah, it was insane. Yeah. Yeah. That so, thing yeah. was flames well, were, you know, 10 feet high. Biggest thing, yeah, everybody's yeah. safe. Yeah. You got out of the car, he got out of the car. The cars are fixable. So. It's definitely Friday the 13th. All right. Well, good luck. Hope you good feel better. You. Thank you. Yeah. Yep. Go Sprouts. There we go. Okay. All right. Buddy.
Hey guys, there's some messed up stuff going. So again, even round two, Invitational, I just do who? But David Gates. I, I don't even know what's going on. It's getting freaky at this point, but we definitely know we can beat him. So we'll be in round three. Let's roll. Round three. Oh. 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 Yeah, that was a pass. That was a great pass. That's the best pass you guys have made. That was unbelievable. What's up, guys? Uh, so, uh, second round, we'll race David Gates and uh, beat David Gates. Uh, not saying anything about that car. That car is badass. I mean, it's Lizzie Musi's old car, and he can drive it. So, uh, we're just uh, grateful to be on the third round. All right, so we drew Stinky Pinky. I have never raced him before. So the good thing about that is he's never raced me. So he doesn't even know what is his spec and he'll see it when he gets it. That was a great race. Uh, Stinky Pinky, uh, I think I got him at the tree. I got him for a while and then I blew the tires off and there's nothing you could do at that point with a guy that's that fast. Uh, he came around me like a freight train. So it is what it was, right? So we, we love it. Thank you. I don't know, it's not my weekend. I don't know, I just don't, I don't know, red light, and I, that was more than a red light. That was like five and a half minutes early. So we'll figure it out.
semi-finals. Outlaw Big Tire. I raced Birdman. Well, as you know, Birdman was, uh, what, 2017 season champ of MPK. Uh, he's no joke. I mean, he's one of the legends. He's probably one of the fastest guys out there. So just to race with him was a pretty big honor. And so here we are. And we made the win. Uh, it was a little sketchy. Uh, halfway down the track, we pedaled it twice. I seen him come up. I pedaled it again. I pulled away. And whatever a miracle, I got it. So I'm on to the finals against Larry Larson. Hey guys, so uh, Big Tire Outlaw Finals, uh, me and Larry Larson, as you know, Larry's no joke, right? And so it was an honor to race him. I took off, went hard left, got a little bit of this. A little polish work. A little polish do. work, <laughs> but Larry got the win and on, and oh, thank yeah. you. We're good. See you again All next, right. next week, guys. Appreciate it. Well, I'm in the final four of my fourth race. I, I don't even really know what to say at this point. It's pretty epic, right? It's There's some ladies wearing my shirt. Hey, right on. So, fourth race, I'm in the final four. I drew Kai Kelly. I mean, listen, just to race Kai Kelly is pretty epic, right? So, you know what? We got a fast car. We know we got a fast car. We've seen some of the times on our last pass, and so it's running with everybody else. So, my team's done their job. If I can do my job and go out there, we feel like we have a good shot at winning. So today, if I win this race, I can go home with 50 fans, right? and that's a really big deal for me. So we appreciate that. You know, that's something we really want to do. And you know, listen, I came to this race with expectations. I come to every race with a goal, right? My goal was to—I was at 60 points. And my goal was to be at 100 points. Well, we surpassed that, and now we're in the finals, and now I have a chance to win 50 grand. So. Tell us, just tell us how like the emotions are going to be. Like, tell us what just, about. yeah, I, I mean. It's emotional, and, and I didn't know what else to do but start crying, and that's all I did. And so, you know, I, I, yeah, I, I, wanted, I, I feel grateful, I feel humble. I, I mean, look at the company I'm in, right? And this is this is the best of the best in the world, and I just made it to the finals with those guys, and so, you know, let's just see what I can do next. Here we are. This is the final driver's meeting of the night. We started at 32 cars, 32 drivers, and now I'm down to two. Two drivers still standing. Go to race for $40,000. Put your hands together real quick for these drivers. They battled it out all day long in the heat. Great job. Hey, uh, real quick. John Odom, first question, what the hell are you doing here? My first question. Hey, man. Great job making it all the way to the finals. Brand new car. I mean, dude, you have what, four races on it? Four races. Four races. You made it all the way to the finals. You're racing the points leader. You're also racing the points champion from last year. I mean, Ryan Martin has won the last two races, by the way. And here you are standing next to him. Right now, the way I look at it, the only thing you've got going for you is you are taller than him. Oh. <laughs> I don't, I don't believe that. Not that I can't. No, no, but uh, in all seriousness, man, hey, in all seriousness, 
taking a brand new car, getting where you're at right now, and saying something. I applaud uh, your determination and your program and where it's at. So yeah, put your hands together for John Owen. You've already won two of these. The last two, right? Two in a row. This could be three in a row. If you can win here at Bowling Green, three in a row. I do believe there's only been one other driver that's done that. Lizzie Musi won three in a row. So, Ryan Hay also, don't forget, that bounty still on your back. Folks, if John Odom beats Ryan Martin, $10,000 extra goes into John Odom's pocket for a grand total of $50,000 tonight. But, if Ryan Martin wins, guess what? That same $10,000 now goes into Ryan Martin's pocket, $50,000. So, we just got $50,000 to win now, here tonight. All right, fellas. Well, here's the time that's come for the coin toss. Who is calling? One of the champ calls. One of the champ All right, champ. Here we go. Call it here. Heads. He calls heads. It is tails. John Owen, it is your lane, sir. Which one would you like? Do you know? How do you know? Do you know? You weren't even expecting to win the coin toss. Are you crazy? Where's Jim? Where's Jim? Where's Jim? Where's Jim? David Monday. I got to my car right here. David Monday beat you for car. Does David Monday know what lane you want? Right lane. Oh! Right lane. All right. has taken the right lane. All right, guys, look. Put your cars. Get suited up. All right. We got a final run. You know, a little bit of pressure here because it's only $50,000. No big deal. All right. A lot of pressure. That's right. $50,000, folks. All right. Put your hands together. John Odom and Ryan Ned. Hey guys, so <laughs> race number four, I made it to the finals. Like, holy crap, right? I raced Ryan Martin. Uh, I chose the right lane. We, I think we both left pretty good the same. I got out there, I don't know, three, four hundred feet, it moved to the right, but I'm racing Ryan Martin, so I stayed in it. So, uh, I was, it was a little sketchy for a minute. I don't know how close we were, but we were pretty close going through the light. But listen, this is my fourth race. I made it to the finals. Nobody's done that in MPK history. I'm the first one to do it. And I ran Ryan Martin, who is a legend. He's winning all these races. To be racing with him in the finals is is epic. So I'm grateful. I'm grateful for everybody that got me here, my sponsors, my staff, my son, who supports me every race. 
Trace and Kenzie and I mean Dane, everybody, everybody on this team, I couldn't do it without you. So As you know, I got Kai Kelly's ass last weekend, so I got a couple stickers to put on his car. So we feel like this is a good time to do it when all his fans are around and he's signing autographs. So that's what we're doing. Let's put the, the let's put the lion inside where he can see it. I feel like guys, I feel like I owe Kai Kelly a sticker from last week, as you guys know. Yes, you do. Nope, I'll put right. I want everybody to see it. So. No, I want I want him to look at the lion. I want everybody to see it. <laughs> hey, it's not bad. Where's the lion at? Yeah. Go put it right. No, let's put it. Uh, it's right out his door, right there. Yeah, put it right here. Yeah. <laughs> That way you can see it good. So, uh, Invitational, here we are, Daddy Dave. Daddy Dave's got a pretty fast car. He's been running good last few passes. I didn't see his pass yesterday, but, you know, he's been a pretty fast car. So, uh, Jim's in front of me. So that much makes it nice about our team. So we got the same setup. So Jim's number three, I'm number nine. Jim is racing a car that's broke. So he's gonna go out there and put a hot tune in it and see if the track will hold it. If it does, that just gives me data for the next pass. And hopefully we go out and win and uh, move on to the second round. Yeah, Shoes. that was a great fucking race. I Shoes. didn't see. I didn't hear you. And that's why I was like, <laughs> "Yeah, your car's as loud as mine, I bro." This wind like, come on, I don't get it.
Man, that was awesome. That was an awesome race. Yeah, I, that's the first hey. time I've ever run you. That was yeah. awesome. Hey, that car's fast, dude. Yes, sir. That car's fast. Sure. Appreciate it. Boom. That's a winner right there. Hey guys, first round invitational. So I do Stan Allen. He drives the Thunder car, as you know. Uh, Wayne, who used to drive that car, passed away last year. And so I actually have Wayne's sticker on my car. So it is an epic honor to race that car. You know, he's fast. I mean, he made it into the Invitational, so he's that car's fast. So, you know, we're going to not take anything away from him, and we're going to be on our A game. Of course, I hope we win, but just to race that car is an honor. And, you know, I met Wayne one time in a funny situation. We'll talk about it later, but he was really cool to me. And I, you know, I treasure and honor that moment that we spent together, and I uh, hope he's watching from heaven. Some reason that train no, did it every clearing. time. It's clearing out every time. The only way that, it's all right, buddy. Hey guys, so first round of the trace knoll. We drew Stan Allen, we pulled up, did a burnout, kicked out of gear, backed up, did it again, kicked out of gear. So we thought we'd just run it, pulled up as soon as I got on it, broke a little 